also na na-hold. Pero if yung parang she needs to like that, hindi. Oh I can't God. believe. Kasi nakikita namin madala si Cass. But like two moms in the group. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh ma! Like, wow. The last time we were together, you, oh I didn't have pa. Oh yeah, wala. Pero nabuntis ka na noon. Yeah, but, but it wasn't out. Yeah. Hindi pa siya tao. Oh my God. Hindi pa siya bailing. Yeah. <laughs> Oh. 
Let's go. Let's do it. So, okay, isa isa lang tayong tatakbo. talking nga na parang may mga nababasa kami kung ano-ano. So guys, ito na official statement. Vlog na to ni Kams. Hindi po nag-aaway ever ang vlogger best besties. Besties tuloy. Besties. Bestie. Anyway, kasi guys, to be honest, matanda na kami. You can't expect na every time magkikita-kita. Hindi talaga kami makakomplete. Mahirap na po. May anak na si Chris. Based po siya sa Cebu. Kung bakit hindi kami kasama? Bakit niya? Sagutin mo. Pakisagot, Maggie. Kasama sa yung kasama sa trip na yun, maaga matulog lang. <laughs> Ay, wait! Nag-clubbing naman kami sa Cebu! Oh my God! Clubbing ka! Ano kayo ko eh? Uy, late na yung one! So, kaka! <laughs> Totoo, late na rin yun for me. Aminin mo, Kams, tulog ka na rin pa yung time. Ma, okay lang kasi ako, Pat and Lorene, pumupunta rin naman kami sa South of Manila. Oh, 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 <laughs> so okay, so that is the press release. Okay, so... Okay, so oh. Yes! It's really hard for everyone to get to meet. Even us, like here in Metro Manila, it's so hard for us to meet. Super tagal na! Super tagal na. So, Lisa, it took like two weeks to plan it. Ito na yung adulting kasi nag-schedule tayo in advance. But it's really, really super hard for us to see each other all the time. That's why it's always like small pockets lang because not everyone is like, even ngayon nga, kala namin will be complete but Nicole is not here. May last minute meeting. Yeah, yeah. But anyway, we've all been friends for more than a decade na, no? Yeah, yeah And like, we've experienced like, youth together and now still youthful. Did we ever fight? No, no. Parang we're a normal so, burkata oh, na parang. Oh, oh. Fights. Like everybody. Well, so it's friendship lang. Ending. Oh, oh. Ano, yeah, no, no, nagkataon no. lang na pareho yung oh, oh. dating like, nung moods. I would say, lahat, lahat sa burkata, level-headed. Oo, oh, oh. tsaka kunwari nagkahasagutan. Hindi siya umaabot sa point na magkakampihan si Kunmare, Kams and Lau, me and Nicole. Wala ever. Parang wala naman tayong major sagutan. Never, never. Parang wala naman group sagutan. I think our only like sagutan was during our Christmas. Yeah, yeah, when we were passing the gifts. Hour. Remember yun? That's our <laughs> ally. Passing the gifts. Napaingan yun. Ang gulo! Alam mo na nang hitay ko lang nabuksa ko na eh. Please, please, please. Yeah, but... 
Ah, uh, BJ was like, yeah. ano ba to? Gift giving or away? <laughs> Ako ano, yung shots lang natin. Like, oh. eight years ago. Eight <laughs> First years ago. fight namin ever ni Lerin. We were in Iloilo ba? <gasps> oh, oh, I think. Uh, uh, oh, Iloilo. Ibang bansa, Iloilo. Ay, <laughs> even city. city. <laughs> and then, we were at this place and we were playing a game. Tapos, oh. kailangan yung drink. And then she didn't see you take the shot. Oh, oh and accused me of being <laughs> a cheater, not an accused. honest, of being a dishonest person who oh. wouldn't drink the drink. Sabi ko, ininom ko. Sabi niya, hindi mo, hindi, bakit nandiyan? Sabi ko, ah, dibigyan mo, lagyan mo ulit, uh, ininom ko. Oh, yeah, ininom nga. Tapos yun na, DM, gano'n. Yung away. Close. But anyway, to like other, in other news, we have new shirts from Hungry Homies. Ano ulit na kasulat dito? Lisa. Lisa. Bakit <laughs> may ganon? Sabi niya, ano yung nakasulat? Bulong pa nga kayo. Bite me? Nakamodulate pa yung voice niya. And then in front, you'll see how we Hawakan ko na ngayon kam mo. Thank you. Um, ano lang po siya, 199. Uy, <laughs> pagkara ba? Hala, hala. 199 itong video. Nakalimutan ko lang yung... Uh, I'm gonna, uh, 799. Hindi siya ay, sorry, sorry, sorry. Bye, Lisa. <laughs> <laughs> so, mga, thank you so much, Lisa okay. Kahayon, for the assist. Welcome. Ay, presenting! Oh. All I want for Christmas is you. 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 back home after our bonding sesh. Sienna was brought home by her father ahead of me so that she could take a nap. And so yeah, we have some visitors! Hey. Who's here to visit us? Hi! And we also have Nai Nai! <laughs> AKA, spoiler. Spoiler alert. We're already packing up. Ito na po tayong lahat, ladies and gentlemen. Oh my gosh, this is it. Shoe. This is how I'm packing. It's the only way you can get to pack. Have Miss Rachel on so that she'll stop following Mama and Mama can pack. See, she saw Mama. Hi. <laughs> couple name. Loggy has come to pick us up to bring us back to Earth to give us life. So we're gonna have Korean! I'm already wearing my shirt because I love Hungry Homies so much. So much. I don't know because I'm so excited to pack all of them. Is there a lot of fun? Yeah, there's a lot of fun. From the packaging. True. Say hi to the vlog! Iba ba! Iba ba! We 
we just realized. Happy Thanksgiving! Happy Thanksgiving! It's also our last um, dinner date as residents of the same city. Let me prove you wrong. I know, um, of this year. Oh, of this year. Uh oh, residents of this city this year. Pero willing to travel, willing to travel for friendship. Uh, I am. It's recorded on my vlog, so. Ooh. Kayo rin, as long as you guys are willing to go here. Oh, oh for sure. And then we'll have a live item. Okay, 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 okay. I will wait at your condo. But even also, if you're not there. we're so excited to have our room at the Kokoro House. Camille said it's like perfect. Gusto ko yung lumayo ka sa. Kasi Back home. And the packing continues. Cinebug have to try again. Raise eyebrows like this. And then, how do you wink like this? Wink. <laughs> I'll look at mommy so that Cinebug can do it. Oh no, what? I have to do this, okay? <laughs> Perfect wink. Okay, so we have transferred. A lot of our stuff already at our new residence and then the ones that we will be needing for this week are at my parents home where we're staying for a week before we move to the new Kokoro house if all goes well the move is happening just can't believe it i can't believe that this is finally happening because it's just it's, we started this process in 2020 and now we're almost at the end of 2022 and i just oh my gosh I feel like it's been years, years as in like more, more than the actual number of years that we've been in this like designing, building and everything phase. So yeah, it feels so surreal because Kokoro House truly is our dream home. We started designing it 2020. So imagine that we've been waiting for this since 2020 and it's now finally here. And there are moments where I just feel the like, is this really real? Is this really happening? And I until we finally move in, I'll still keep thinking that, that oh my god, is this real? It's finally happening. I've held on to these references, my Pinterest boards, our renders, our perspectives, our plans, the floor plans, the layouts. We've held on to this for years and now they finally come to life. Grab it. And I can't wait to show you guys. I will take my time though until I finally show it to you guys. I really want to take my time with this one because it's this is, you know, as far as I know, our, our forever home. So, I don't want to rush it. I don't want to rush making it right. And in case you're wondering, Sienna isn't here. The scene before that was the previous day. Today is a new day already. I couldn't vlog yesterday. When we were moving out and moving in and transferring stuff to Kokoro House, I couldn't vlog that day. It was just too hectic and too tiring. And I was alone. Yoni was back in our previous residence, like fixing the stuff that were supposed to go to the new residence and the ones that are coming here with us to my parents' home. So I was alone. And the Kokoro girls were also with Yoni because they were also still fixing stuff at the old residence. So I was just really windang. This is the first time the vlog has seen me drive. I feel like this is the first time you guys have seen me drive. Might be a shock to a lot of you, but I actually know how to drive. I remember when I was learning back in college, my driver was not teaching me. And the moment that I got my driver's license, I insisted on driving myself to school, to Ateneo. And it was so far from where I lived before, but I insisted because like I really wanted to feel independent. I wanted to feel like an adult. And now, I'm just too, too lazy to drive. I don't want to drive. <laughs> If our driver is not available, I ask Yoni to drop me off, pick me up. Okay. But today is different because everyone's busy. Yoni is at the new house. He's at Kokor house and he is making sure that everything is in order so that we can really, really move in this weekend. So he's with the driver and my parents are also using their driver. My brother is not here. I had no choice. <laughs> I had to shoot, I had to go out and shoot some content for a deadline that I have with a brand. So, I drove. 
as an independent woman that I am. So I've already returned my shoes, the ones that I did bring to our temporary home. And so I returned them here because I don't want them boxed up for a week, especially because Philippine heat is something else. But in December, guys, I wanted to show you this one. This already happened before moving here to my parents' place. Like maybe probably last year before moving here. This was a result of the pandemic. I know a lot of you have experienced the same. And it pains me because it used to be like this. And these are my wedding shoes, guys. So I feel so sad. Can anyone tell me how I can fix this? I'm so sad. My wedding shoes. So yeah, that is why my trauma na ako with the shoes. That's why I need them out. Even my bags as well that I brought to our old place. I brought them back here and unboxed them first. Also unboxed some of my clothes. So I, I didn't have all my clothes when we moved to our old place. A lot of them were still here at my parents' place. As well as my shoes and my bags. A lot of them were left behind here. I only brought a, a few. But now I returned them here. Because I don't want them boxed up as well for a week. And also I have so much work and events this week that I need to see my stuff. But anyway, this is already good. This state is good because yesterday was a complete mess. But I've already fixed a lot of them. I'm gonna fix some more because I really need to nest. I'm gonna be here for a week and I can't have them like all messy and jumbled up. And then I'm gonna pack everything as well because a lot of the stuff here actually... You might think that these are like stuff that I brought and unpacked. And then I will pack again. No, I mean that would be impractical. A lot of these were already here. So I still have to pack these for the new house. So yeah, that's all my skincare that I brought with me before. And these are all the ones that I left behind here. All my perfumes have to start packing all of those as well. My candles, my glasses. A lot of those would be sold actually. I'm gonna be selling a lot of stuff because I want to just bring the stuff that I really, really use. But this packing and moving and then unpacking again and then packing and then unpacking again is giving me so much anxiety because I'm not just unpacking for myself but I'm also unpacking and packing for Sienna, the entire household. A lot of her stuff are actually already in boxes and it's already in the new house. But of course with Sienna, we still have to unpack some of her toys as well. We have a few clothes also that's just on rotation while we're here. I want Sienna to feel super at home and not to feel like she's a gypsy <laughs> moving around. So that's why I spent the entire day yesterday just fixing her room, fixing all her stuff there so that she'll love it there. She doesn't have a play area because of here, so it's all in her room. So I fixed that as well. So yeah, just making sure there's a system here while we're here. But at least I didn't have to worry about, you know, unpacking our <laughs> cooking stuff because I'm just using my parents. And also the food, we can lang kami dito. <laughs> So yeah, I don't know how I'm gonna handle the Kokoro house move really. Sobrang OC ko pa and I really like, I really wanna organize everything. And so if I feel like there's just one thing that's not in place, it, it's gonna bug me forever. So I want to start everything right. Like I don't, I don't want to just unpack for the sake of unpacking and just, you know, figure it out along the way and then, you know, slowly fix things. I want everything to be fixed properly from the get-go. Because I feel like once you get busy again, especially during the holidays, you'll get lazy. It's never gonna get fixed. And I really want to have the pantry of my dreams, make sure that everything's well organized. There's a good system. I'm hyping myself up too much and that's why I'm getting anxiety. And then I just figured out now that um, Sienna's old nanny did pala fix all of Sienna's like old stuff properly. So everything's a mess upstairs. I also have to fix that and categorize everything and box up everything properly because I want to keep all her old clothes still. I know a lot of you always ask me that like, when are you gonna sell Sienna's old clothes and old toys? I'm saving them because I still want a baby number two in the future. Not right now. Whatever bulge you see on my tummy. Not a baby. It's not happening anytime soon guys. But anyway, I'm keeping them still because we don't know. Like I still might have a girl next so and a lot of her stuff are also very gender neutral so yeah i'm keeping those still so wait until baby number two after baby number two for sure i will be giving away and selling a lot of sienna's stuff sienna's old stuff okay back to unpacking and organizing Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Bye, bye. 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 B
Okay. Okay, mommy help. No problem. Wow. Wow. Oh, no, no. 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 No, no, no. no. Okay, mama, mama. Time to keep. Here you go, my love mango. Mommy already got for you. Mango. Here. My love, it's the same. Can mommy have? Thank you. Can Dada have? Yes, okay. Dada, Dada can have mango. Oh, wow. He does. Mmm. Yum. In a bag. On drinking from Mama's bottle. And then she always does this. She puts the alcohol right there and then. Mama show. Okay, Mommy also. Mama water, please. Mama water, please. Okay, Mama. Mommy put here. She likes drinking from adult cups. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This one? Ah, this one? This one. No. What? Fine. The fine. Ah, the pink one. Fine. The pink doesn't have anything. Nothing there. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Here, my love. Bread? No. Which one, my love? Um, Chicken? Pink. Bread? Okay. Mama, so. Mommy, also. Cheers. Mommy get this one. Okay, send us turn. Mommy, help, help, help. Okay, Mama, Mama help. Hey, Aqua. Yeah, Mama. we will watch, my love. But have to finish first. Mama help. Mama here. Mama help. She's Mama. so impatient that she Mama. wants to watch. Mama help. Mama help. But Santa Bug also help. Yeah. Yeah, this one also. Correct. Final one and then Anka. Hey. Yellow. Wow. Wow. <laughs> Yee! Anka time. Sorry, my love. Have to come back. Sorry, sorry. Mama have to hug. 
Sienna's tummy? Where's Sienna's chin? Where's Sienna's cheeks? Where's Sienna's eyebrows? Eyebrows? How is your eyebrow so high? Where's Mama's eyebrows? Mama's eyelashes? Mama's teeth? Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no, Mama will move now. Okay, Mama's ano is painful na. Mama! Ay, 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 ay. Cute, cute. Mama here. Kiss Mama's cheeks. <laughs> Sleep. 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 Open it. Yes? Me went to your day, Daddy. Well, in the morning, I woke up. That was the start of my day. And when I woke up, I was still tired, so I snoozed. <laughs> I don't I don't think he needs to make you quiet his day. He's been a tired manual laborer, bringing stuff to and from, to and from to clock her house. How would you describe the state? Are we truly, truly moving in, in a week? No. In a week. See, I've been telling okay. you that we adjusted and then now you're gonna adjust your timeline so close to it. Why didn't you listen to mama? What are you talking about? I've been saying that we won't make it December 4 before. I said you were I... adamant that December 4 and no extensions. No, but before when we were planning this, I said I don't think we'll finish December 4 and you said we will. You were the one who was adamant. Yeah, but now I'm not anymore. We're fine. When it's too away. late. It's never too late. It's never too late to say I'm sorry. <laughs> I did not marry him for his vocal <laughs> or, abilities. Or capabilities of remembering lyrics, apparently. It's not like that. He said, <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Is it too late now to say sorry? No, that's the word what was being saying. That's what Despacito. <laughs> But yeah, we won't get to move in, I guess. You think we are accepting this? I've accepted it already. I've, I've been sleeping well now for the past week because I accepted it. Me too. I think I'm, I think it might be better actually. Maybe we can move in slowly so that by the time Sienna comes in... Yeah, because I don't want to rush it now because everything is so messy still. So we yeah, just force same. it See, I keep it's... asking you and then you said... I, I was hopeful. <laughs> the end. I love you. See you in the next vlog. It may or may not be at the Cocora house. Probably not. <laughs> it is. Is it the fault of Pieni? Pieni surfaces? <laughs> Stop speaking. <laughs>